Okay, guys, here's the plan for today. We're going home. But not until. Not until we beat Crisis Core, okay? Dude, last night's stream was so good, wasn't it? Oh, frick. I didn't turn on the camera. Man. Sure has nothing to do with Blizzard nerving the boss when Liquid is sleeping, but Echo would have won regardless. However, it's how Blizzard handled it. Listen, you want to know? You, you want to know how I really feel about this? A lot of people talk about like, uh, well, EU gets it first. Uh, you know, if EU gets it first, EU has to deal with the the hard version, and then they hot fix it while they're asleep, and then NA gets an easier version, and then they push ahead, and then. NA goes to bed and then they hot fix something again and then EU gets it and then they get ahead. You, you know what I mean? How I honestly feel about the race of the world first. I feel like if you're sleeping, you ain't trying. That's the truth. I I don't think any of those teams deserve to win because all those teams slept. Ten days? What's ten days without sleep? It's not that bad. Okay? <laughs> no, how, how I actually feel is the same way everybody everybody with a, any, any degree of like sanity thinks. It's, they, they need to do a global release. Because um, there's, because it, it does actually go both ways, right? Like EU gets the first crack at it, but then EU might go to bed and then Blizzard is in America, right? So then they might do an update or something while NA is playing and EU is asleep. So then, so then NA gets an advantage at that point, it, but then EU gets the reset first, and so then they can go, they, you know what I mean? So, um, well, NA can, NA gets to know what strats EU is doing. It, it's just stupid, right? There's, it's impossible to say which one is truly better, I think. I think it's actually impossible to say which one is truly better, um, after, like, seeing this for so many years, but, uh, they just need to do a global release. They're doing a global release for like expansions and, and classic and all this. They just need to do it. So. It's lethal. Guys, I was joking. I obviously don't think anybody should stay up 10 days in a row. Okay. <laughs> like, dude, S-Fan, you can't stay up 10 days in a row. <laughs> First time chatter, Niner Gang? Yo, what up, Sourdough Joe? <laughs> Nine days is fine, but ten, no way. Oh. <laughs> but I already started? Oh, frick. Jake Anderson, thank you for the 20 months. Guys, I hope you guys are having a good morning so far. I hope you guys are having a really good morning. Um, how about that stream last night, dude? Last night's stream was super fun. Congrats to Starforge for the rest of World First. Thank you. It was all Starforge and not the uh, not the not the players. Okay, it was all Starforge and had nothing to do with how good the players were. Hundred <laughs> percent. Yeah. Watch me. I'll do it. What's up, Mabs? Hey. Um. No, dude. It's uh. It's cool. I, I'm. 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 I like a lot of those Echo guys. I mean, I, I've known a lot of those Echo guys for years. Um. I mean, I, I've, I, I'm friends with people on, on Liquid Echo, um, or Limit, Limit Liquid. I would, I would, are they, are they officially Liquid? Liquid Limit? Like, I don't even know what they officially are anymore, but they're a Limit, and then Complexity Limit, and then Liquid Limit, but are they just Liquid now? Liquid. Huh. Liquid? They're solid. Yeah. They're solid? Solidus. Okay. Dude, last night's stream was so fun. Uh, we'll do a quick little Reddit recap. Good morning, Isaac. Good morning, Cold Heart. Uh, so I tweeted this out. I'm looking for more editors. I'm looking for more editors. Um...
I'm looking, um, I'm looking for more editors. I think I want to add maybe like one or two editors to, to the staff. Um, I'm working with a, I'm, I'm working with like a new team on stuff and I need, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm looking at options right now for adding editors. Um, I tweeted out if you guys are interested and you, you're good, you know what you're doing, uh, reply to the tweet. Just reply to the tweet. Please play FF7 Remake again after uh, CC Reunion. I'm thinking about playing it before... I'm thinking about playing uh, the remake again before Remake Part 2 comes out. But that would be like next year. I have no idea what I'm doing. Can I have a job? Sure. Okay, let's see. Uh, I kind of want to get started playing the game pretty early today. Oh my gosh. Okay, speaking of last night's stream, dude. Speaking of last night's stream... Somebody leaked, linked me something. And said... A few people actually uh, linked me, but... They're like, leaked? Like, it was a joke, but they said, oh, this leaked. Delete this. Let me see if I can find this. Where is it? I deleted it without thinking about it. I was like, oh shit. And I deleted it. I didn't even see it. I can't find it. Basically what happened was when we were watching the car chase, we were watching the car chase. And I was watching the stream of the person watching the car chase. <laughs> and in their browser, in their browser history, they had porn. <laughs> and I, was, I, I didn't know. They were like, dude, you need to delete this. And I just deleted it. I was like, okay. And I deleted it. And I didn't think of anything. <laughs> and then I saw it afterwards. And I, dude, I was dying laughing. And I was like, dude, I should not have deleted that. That was so funny. <laughs> Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Oh, the person who posted it deleted it. Okay. Dude, that is so funny, though. The person who posted this deleted it. I was just joking when I said killing 30 people. But look at this. But it's like... I was laughing at, like... The Wait, hold on. So the person who posted this... I think the person who posted this thought that this was actually my browser history and they probably got embarrassed and deleted it. A very relaxed, like you're following this police chase that is not even like he's getting passed to all of a sudden talking about a, a plane crash. But I'm watching a like, YouTube video uh, way more serious. crashing on the beach near the pier today. A witness took this video. And dude, as a joke, you know, because Saucy does this. Saucy, Saucy does the chases and he streams it. And then I watch Saucy stream. You know he did this on purpose, like, as a meme. <laughs> he did this on purpose because he goes and he waits on it for, like, two seconds. Engine aircraft. <laughs> it's <just> like... <laughs> dude, I actually, dude, I died. Whenever I realized what it was, I was just, like, laughing so hard. It was so funny, dude. It was such a good one. Such a good one. But honestly, like, yeah, you know, pe people, like, don't, they don't know that it's, like, not me, maybe? I don't know. Richard Hammond, oh, okay, wait, we already saw this one. Uh, my worst quality is that I'm a perfectionist. What is this? Yeah. Um, yeah. Craig's did this. That's great. Yeah, we suck ass, dude. Dude, I, I, I didn't even arena last week. Right now in Wrath of the Lich King, they're doing the bonus leveling. They're, um, they're doing the bonus leveling. They're doing, uh, AV weekend, like joyous journeys. I, dude, I haven't, I like have not logged in. 
Like, if you want to level a character in, in Classic WoW right now, now is the time. But I don't know. Dude, I, I am, like, I'm, like, losing it, man. I'm, like, even Dragonflight. I haven't logged into Dragonflight. I haven't logged into to Classic. Like, I, I don't, I don't know. Like, every time I think about it, every time I think about it, I'm like, oh, yeah, like, I should do this or I want to do this. But then, like, I don't know. Like, I, I'm just really just, I don't know. Like, I, I I'm like, I, I'm, I don't know. Like, I, I've said this before, but I think maybe, I, like, I don't even like WoW. I think I just like Paladins. And I, I got I, specifically in like Burning Crusade and specifically in Vanilla. Wasn't Wrath when you quit the game back in the day? History repeating itself, maybe. I, yeah. Like, I mean, this is whenever I originally quit the game. I, the first time I quit the game, like, not like hard quit. I hard quit in Cataclysm. But I quit in Wrath because I was like, I was kind of bored and like I didn't have anybody to play with. But now, like, I have some people to play with. I have people to play with. But like, I just, I don't know, man. I also hard quit in Kata. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know, like, I don't know what it is. Like, I'm even, like, I'm even, like, starting to get to the point where I'm like, do I even want to, like, push to go get glad this season? Like, I'm, I'm really close to just kind of being like, eh. I don't know. I don't I don't want to. I don't really want to quit until Cataclysm. But I just kind of am like I don't know. I mean like even even if you think about it now, like I've been streaming longer. I've been streaming longer than I played WoW originally. And I've done, like, I've accomplished almost every single thing that you can accomplish in in Classic WoW. Like, between Vanilla and Burning Crusade. And I did it with a class that, like, is considered to be, like, not good. The only thing I didn't get was a rank one. But, it's whatever. Well, if you're not happy playing, don't force it. Yeah, I mean, I, I haven't been. I haven't been forcing it at all. But what I'm saying is, like, I don't know. Like, I still I still want to play. Um, It's not that. I still want to. Part of me still wants to play because there's still certain things that I do want to do. But do I want to do the the stuff that I have to do to get there? You know what I mean? But it just kind of is what it is. Do you want to play or do you feel obligated to play? Mm, it's a good question. Uh, I but it's it's not. I think it's a good question, but it's not that. Um, I don't know what it is. But I'm really, uh, I will figure it out. I'll figure it out. Because, uh, I mean, as of right now, it's just I'm just kind of taking a break from it or whatever. But I'm not really taking a break, but, like, I kind of am. But uh, if I want to play again, I'll just play again. I do kind of feel obligated to play this weekend because this Yo. weekend is crazy leveling. And I feel like I need to level a new class if I want to keep playing. You know? Tazaroni, thank you for the 16 months. Ollie Mac, thank you for the three months. You're facing external and internal pressure on the matter, so you feel stuck. Well, I don't really have a whole lot of external pressure, because, like, there's no real external pressure to play. Um, but there is, like, I, I do still want to... Here's the thing. Part of me still wants to at least, like, push for Gladiator. 
right? But the, the truth is, I think I'm going to give it one more patch before I really, like, if the Old War patch is fun, if the Old War patch is fun, then I'll be fine. But if the Old War patch is not fun, a, a lot of it, honestly, dude, a lot of it, too, has to do with, like, um, the content, right? Uh, is the truth. A lot of it has to do with, like, like streaming it. I feel like, um, I feel like I need to stream it differently if I want to keep playing it. Um, and I don't know what that means, but the way I stream it right now, I think is non-conducive to me continuing to play the game. You know what I mean? I mean, that's kind of what it is right now, G Smiley. But like, I, I also have like two ways that I want to play the game. Like I like parsing and I like pushing and I like, I like having like good numbers. But uh, not only that, I um, I also like I also like making it into good content. Like if I, if it's it's if it's being made into good content, then then you'd feel better about it automatically. You know what I mean? Which might mean like trying to pug. I don't know. Uh, if S fan was a mascot, okay, I'm not watching this. Okay. <laughs> That's so good. That's so funny. Uh, you made this face looking at the camera today, so I made it into an emote. It's terrifying. Time for another run of God of War. FIFA 24 about to be well. Wait, what? Someone made this mod? With Killian and Mbappe and, and Messi? That's hilarious, dude. You know what's crazy? Dexerto used to be such a meme. But like they tweet they get these they get tons of likes on their tweets now. Like out of nowhere. But like a few years ago, Dexerto was such a meme because like we all thought it was like a, a, a like AI generated articles off of like LSF posts. It still is. Yeah, I mean, but like, I mean, it was even more so. Like, I, I legit thought it was like AI generated posts. Yeah, like bots, exactly. Have you heard this? Dude, it is so cold. Dude, I really need to loud mic. I've been looking at it and I, and I haven't had time. I think Dark and Darker is a very good. I think Dark and Darker is a very good game. Silly, thank you for the Prime.
This is good. Yo. What's up, Coolios? Shop Zane, thank you for the 21 months. No parents house today? Uh, no. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm going to beat Crisis Core before I leave for my parents' house. And to be honest, maybe we shouldn't eat. Oh, man. Uh, maybe I'll save the rest of Recap to do it. Maybe I'll stream at my parents' house, but... Tell us you had this alter ego Instagram link. Oh, we've, we've seen that before. Thank you for the five dollars. Just wait for it. <laughs> I was thinking about that too. I don't understand how the wing. I don't understand how this works at all. I don't understand. <laughs> oh, hey, look at you. Hey, look at me. I'm over here. Hey, look where you going. Oi, what's the matter? Wait, this Don't is their channel like trailer. Hey, bro, International out. Wing Chun oh, Academy. Have been with a guy like me before? Oi, boys, check this out. <laughs> what happened? Just leave us alone, all right? We don't want any trouble. These were the original Power Rangers. <laughs> Wing Chun Kung Fu is fast, easy to learn, and devastatingly effective. At the International Wing Chun Academy, students learn dynamic self-defense skills which may be applied from the first lesson. These skills are within the reach of anybody, regardless of age or physique, as Wing Chun does not rely on brute strength to be successful. The International Wing Chun Academy was established by Grandmaster Jim Fung in Adelaide, South Australia in 1973. Grandmaster Fung is recognised worldwide as one of the most skilled and knowledgeable practitioners of Wing Chun Kung Fu. He trained for more than 45 years under Great Grandmaster Chu Shong Tin, a closed door student of the legendary Yip Man who took Wing Chun from China to Hong Kong in 1948. From his many years of experience, Grandmaster Fung developed a unique training system which adapted the traditional Chinese method of training for modern day use, while still retaining the authenticity of pure Wing Chun. 
This system equips students with highly efficient self-defence skills which lead to the development of thought force at the higher levels. An excellent example of Wing Chun thought force is Grandmaster Fung's famous one-inch punch in which his fist, placed just one inch from its target, could send an opponent reeling backwards by three metres or more. <laughs> as well as providing excellent self-defence skills and fitness, Wing Chun improves posture, assists with weight loss and stress control, and improves concentration, confidence and overall well-being. The International Wing Chun Academy has established a worldwide reputation for the high quality and professional delivery of its teaching program. Its classes are conducted by fully qualified instructors in safe, clean and friendly environments. Casual classes are available at all of the Academy's headquarters seven days a week from morning to night. General classes for men, women and children are offered <laughs> along with a wide range... I don't know. Dude, that made me laugh so hard. <laughs> Seven days a week from morning to night. Right. General classes for men, women Bitch. and children are offered... just gets rocked. <laughs> General classes for men, women and children are offered along with a wide range of specialty uh. classes in areas such as fitness, relaxation, sparring and street defence. Wing Chun Kung Fu is the world's fastest growing and most effective martial art, but it needs to be taught correctly like to be useful in a real life situation. The International Wing Chun Academy has decades of experience teaching Grandmaster Jim Fung's Wing Chun Kung Fu, and its senior instructors are among the world's most talented martial artists. Visit the International Wing Chun Academy today to discover how you can improve your health and protect your personal safety with the amazing art of Wing Chun Kung Fu. Dude, here's what I think. I, I think a lot of this stuff's like legit. Like like a lot of I think a lot of martial arts are, are legit in terms of if you were to take somebody who who knows how to do like who knows how to do this. And then they go up against a guy who doesn't know how to do anything, right? It, and some guy's trying to assault you or whatever. It's probably highly effective uh, as like a form of self-defense, right? If some guy's trying to jump, it's probably highly effective as a, as a, as a form of self-defense. But I do think that if there's a guy who's just really freaking big and strong... Like, it basically what it does is, it like, knowing how to do this stuff, like, let's say, let's say, okay, we're going to talk about ratings. Let's say, let's say you're, like, a 70 overall. This gives you a buff that makes you, like, an 81 overall, right? But if you go up against a guy who's, like, a 90 overall, then he's still going to beat you. You know what I mean? Like, this gives you, like, a buff. But it, like at a certain point, somebody is going to be so much bigger and stronger than you that it's not going to matter. I, I did um, – so, so in college, uh, we had like uh, jujitsu classes. We, like, like there was like a – you have to do like a PE credit, right? And uh, they had like all kinds of martial arts classes. And what they had was one of my friends, he uh, – for jujitsu, they had like bring, bring a friend to class day. You know, bring a friend who has no idea what they're doing to class. And one of my friends was like, dude, you got to come to this thing, right? Because, you know, I was a big, strong guy, whatever. And I showed up and they did sparring and stuff. And it was just like, nobody could do anything against me. Because they were like, they were like, okay, like there's the different chokes and there's this. And like at one point, I don't remember what it was. It was like, uh... I was on top, okay, so like I was on top of a guy and they're like, okay, so now he's gonna go for a gi choke and he goes like this and he starts doing a gi choke and I literally did this. I just put my hands here and I just started pulling his hands apart and then I stood up and they were like, okay, okay you can't do that. <laughs> Cause if I drop him, he'll get hurt. But like, if you're, if you're strong enough, <laughs> like, if you're strong enough, then it's like, why don't you just, you know, weight class are always a thing. Yeah, exactly. 
exactly. But I do believe I, I do believe this stuff is legit. Like it like buffs you. You know what I mean? Cause it, yeah, it's just at a certain point, like having like long reach and strength is good. Cause here's the thing, dude. My arms, my long, my arms are so. Look at this. My arms are so long. Like look at look at how look at how long my arms are. You see this? So I I played uh I played O line in high school, right? And uh, like I I I moved to D line whenever whenever I got to college, they put me on D line, but because I'm short, but my longs or <laughs> my arms they're very very long, okay? So right now my arms look extra long because I'm using a wide lens, <laughs> but <laughs> but like. My arms are still long. You know? <laughs> look, look, at, look at how long my arms look with the, with the lens. <laughs> Dude. Number one. Okay. But, um... Yeah. There's people half your size will still fold you in PJJ just to experience. I don't think like half your size. Ha half your size is too much. Like if somebody's 150 pounds, and I mean you could I could be 300 pounds and be like a slob. Happy holidays, this fan and chat. Jorian live. Thank you for the 25 months. Do they go over your knees when you stand side by side? Not not over my knees, but they go. My knees are here. My knees here and like right here. Over your knees would be crazy. Over the knee, okay. But like, so so I I had a friend who, like I had friends who were like six two six three and we would stand like this and like my arms would be as long. So I have like so I, I played tackle Please in high school. Reveal. Pog. So even though I was short, I'm only six feet tall. Like I also high school everybody's shorter in high school. Not everybody, but like, you know, the the there's more shorter people. But I was six foot tall, so I played tackle in high school. So if I went and I was like pass sitting on a guy, I, I had the ability to still like extend, you know. Your wingspan should be as long as you are tall. Yeah, like whenever, like my wingspan is like a six foot two wingspan. But I'm six feet tall. Whenever, whenever they, whenever they measured it was 74. Is there a tape measure here? I'm pretty sure it was 74. How much bigger are people in college? A lot bigger. Like the, basically what happens in college is you basically cut off the bottom heights. So like, there's like no offensive linemen in college that are six feet tall unless they're a center and they're insanely good. Um, let's see what else do we got here. Um. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Merch came in nice. Nice, very good, very good. Very good. Yeah, chat, there's still actually we still have uh merch in stock. If uh if you guys want to get OTK merch, exclamation point OTK merch, it's still in stock. Very cozy. Very, very cozy. Looking good, Jackster. Mr. Clean? <laughs> nice. Leaked as Vandell. S fan text me said happy birthday. Don't leak. I was nice to you or I'll you. <laughs> we cut out. This is old. S fan text me said happy birthday don't leak I was nice to you or I will kill you <laughs> P 
Okay. Um, exploring Kojima Productions' new studio. Oh, frick. I want to watch this, but not now, because I want to start playing the game. So we'll save that one. Henry would be proud. The plan, the result. <laughs> What, you guys didn't like our cake pops? <laughs> what? Our cake pops were good. Some long arms. Oh, frick. Um, easy. What is this? Waves keep on washing over me. Nice. You know what's funny? I was standing in the doorway and I heard that and I was like, damn, that was impressive. Waves keep on washing over me. Cool are the currents of the sea. Waves keep on washing over me. Fun streamer with no pre-leveling requirements plus it's free. Is this dark and darker? Sky Children of the Light, the cool virtual reactive concert. Sky Children of the Light. Um, I'll think about this. But guys, it's 2.30. Listen, guys, it's 2.30. Keep on washing over me. So. Oh, what's up, Trey Day? Um, yeah, welcome to the stream, dude. Uh, I kind of want to start playing Crisis Core. Because what's up, Glorious Nova? Uh, I want to play. I want to play Crisis Core because I need to beat this before I go home. That says Crisis Core, by the way, as fond. Wait, what? Was it Chris Core? Sure. We're gonna beat Crisis Core. Before I go. Fireplace background? Okay. We get cozy chat. Subs. Nice. Bringing out the big guns. Conflict resolved. Oh, nice. Sick. You want to show chat? Yes. But it smells like it's really bad. Yeah, something smells in this room. I'm telling you. I don't know what it is. Look. And show them this one. Where is Grayson? He's gone. But he'll be back. <laughs> he'll always be back. Look at this. 
Wait, so you got all these? Yeah. You got a, you got a fox for Jay. Yeah, wake one? Yeah. And that's all. Wait, what, what about me? <laughs> Ta-da! Oh, nice! <laughs> that's sick, dude. That's so cool. <laughs> you got a soundtrack for this? <laughs> the music is so loud, it's, too. It's so rock and roll. Yeah. These are so great! That's, wait, what about you? I didn't get one. What do you mean you didn't get one? I couldn't find one. You couldn't buy one for yourself? No, it's only for this house. Also, I couldn't get one for the next the house next door because there was just too many people. Because there was like Ms, Emmy Russell, Simply, and then they were all like gone for the holidays anyway. Yeah, but what about you? That's okay. Look! <laughs> these are sick! Yeah, these are sick! These are so cool! These are so good! Doesn't this look like thin? And then this does look like a little green thin. And look, this is so weak. And then it's you. That's so good. And Jay? Jay. That's so cute. That's so good. Yeah, I love them. I can't wait to stuff them. Okay, cool. Okay, we're going to go. I want to go to the uh, Christmas shopping. Okay. Last minute Christmas shopping. So I'll be back. Something in your room smells so bad. I don't know what it is. It's it like, smells like a dead rat. I can't find it out. I've been trying to sniff, but... Yeah. Wait, Bonnie! Huh? I got you one, too. <gasps> oh, thank you! Yeah, no problem. Oh, this is what stinks. Are you smelling it? That's what stinks! <laughs> Why are you smelling What's wrong with you? Hi. What the... See you, Pat. <laughs> What the frick is wrong with you? <laughs> the hell? <laughs> what the hell? He tried to protect me. Leveled up, too. All right, let's see the results. They are your data from last month. All right, bring it. Me from last month. Ah! No improvement whatsoever. Training's over. Ah! What? Yeah, it smells. I don't know what the smell is from. It started. It started smelling after PO Box. Are you ever going home for Christmas? I I thought I was gonna be done by like six. Oh my gosh! It smells so bad in here. Your present is sick. You know why it's just, it's so dope? Why? Because it's the only present, the only present in the entire world. None of it, there's not a single one that looks anything like this present and nothing else in the whole world. Chat, can we get some pogs in the chat? There is not a single thing. You got me a Christmas cool. present? No, well, it's invisible. No other Christmas present in the whole world is invisible, <laughs> except for yours. <laughs> really? <laughs> it's the only thing you. that's invisible. Really? Here you go. That's, oh my gosh, it's so heavy. <laughs> it's so heavy. Are you almost done with this game? Uh, I I'm taking much longer than I thought I was going to. I'm gonna uh, do these while I hang out with you before you leave. Okay. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. I mean, you really don't have to get me a present. And a hippopotamus will do. I didn't. Okay. <laughs> Good, because. I made you a present. Oh! Wait, it's a tree. Wait, it's a little. I should do this on my stream. Oh my god, it stinks in here. Yeah, I don't know. Bro, how do you live like this? I don't know. How's stream going? It smells, uh... It's true smells. Oh, no. wait, hold on. This is candy? What am I talking about? Take it 
protein powder to wait to stop it. No, it's, uh, this game's super good. I don't know where the smell is coming from. I don't know. I threw the sausage away. It doesn't smell good. <laughs> Why now? If you're wondering. I can tell. <laughs> Sorry. Fresh out. Activating combat mode. She put it This is gonna sting. This fan pick either the number 10 or 20 for a surprise. Pick either the number 10 or 20 for a surprise. Um, 10. Gifted subs, Harold. Thank you, man. Thank you for the 20 gifted. Thank you so much, man. Is this the new Final Fantasy? Yeah, it is. Bean, thank you for the six months. Well, I'm gonna turn this down because I think it's like really uh. Abrasive and annoying. Yeah. Or is it that bad? Chad, is it? Is it? Maybe it's just on my uh, headphones, but maybe I can't hear it that well. Bunch of little chocolates. As well. Well, I'm sorry that I'm trying to make Christmas. <laughs> I'm trying to maybe move the mic. Yeah, you can just mute me. Yeah, it's fine. Well, I have a lot of this Christmas. Oh, no, no. Oh, he meant the game is loud. Okay, that's good. Oh. So, yeah, it's fine. Ben gets the tree. Sick. Instead of... Should I do these on my stream? Uh, yeah. So I shouldn't do this here? I mean, maybe. I mean, I, 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 mean, I don't mind if you do. I mean... But, but, uh, if, if they're you... They're not coming back. Activating combat mode. Yeah, I'm leaving. This. Gonna love this! This'll do! Should I give it to you now, or should I wait? Um, I mean, I can wait. How about this? This yeah, I think waiting is good. Okay. What do you think, chat? Jesus. You're in for it now. This is lots of damn. Bonnie, you should actually. So you you played this the original Final Fantasy VII, right? How about yeah. this? That's so taking you down. The, the part that stay. we played while you were gone. Do. You know how uh, in the original they go to Mount uh, Mount go. Nibble, oh, no, and they they go to the reactor, and then, then you, you see the story of like Sephiroth freaking out and the thing. So we we just saw that part of the game oh, from from Zach's POV. Here we go. It's actually so sick. Wait, so now, so when, so when, how long is longer? By now, this is gonna sting. Um, how much longer? You can do it, Zach. Yeah. I think they said like two hours earlier. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna wait for you to get home before I give you your present then, huh? This'll do. Um, that's yeah, fine. Here we go. This is gonna sting. Bye now. Yeah. That's enough. What do you have planned for me to Uh, I don't know yet. 
taking you down a bit. Gonna love this. I know we have my charity stream that's gonna come up. Uh, charity sponsorship. Yeah. Bringing out the big guns. Prove your honor to me. Dude, I'm doing like no damage. Am I crazy? Oh no, you don't. G Slayer. Heads up. This is but, gonna oh, stay. here on the 26th. Right now. Uh, yes. Don't you think it's about time you use that sword? I, I think I'll I think I'll, I'll come back on the twenty sixth. At night? Uh in the evening probably, yeah. That's my birthday. Yeah, I'll be set. That's That's gonna come at night. I'm not This'll do. Oh no you don't! Uh heads up! Or just because there's a while to drive and stuff. Okay. This'll do. Yeah. <laughs> Realistically, right? This is gonna sting! Like Taking you down a pain. No, it's it's like three, four hours. How about this? Oh no, you don't. Here we go. That's enough. Conflict resolved. Conflict resolved. Conflict resolved. Yeah. Big damn, big damn. Big damn judge. His cells are completely useless. Cells. 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 You are a former member of Soldier. Your cellular structure has already mutated. Hollander, you did it to yourself? Yes. After nearly being killed by Genesis, it was really all I could do to survive. I merely borrowed some cells from Genesis. You know you're degrading. Indeed. But, there is still some hope. The gift of the goddess. A pure S-cell sample will stop the degradation process. Pure? There are two of you. On the run. Uh, no. One is a former soldier operative, the other an infantryman. That infantryman carries within his body the last pure S cells in the world. Hey! Do you know the verse in Act 4 that leads into the final act? Of course not. Legend <laughs> shall speak of sacrifice. At world's end. <laughs> the wind sails over the water's surface. Quietly. But surely. Enough about sacrifices and endings. I don't want to hear it. This is the original you don't understand cutscene. the beauty of these words. How tragic. I'm not surprised. Right? This is the original Even cutscene? I didn't understand all of it. The greatest mystery behind the gift of the goddess? The water's surface. And the answer I have arrived at is the life stream. What? There are various theories regarding the missing final act. However, only my theory is correct. And I will prove it to you. Yeah, this is Seer. No, that won't be necessary. <laughs> Ah. Oh. <sighs> Wait. You will understand. This is the hill that it shows. Is that the same hill that it shows in the flashback in the original? Clouds in danger. Back to the reactor. Gotta move quick. Isn't there a cutscene in the original where it's like up against a hill and and he's like laying on the ground or something? Somebody's laying on the. Uh... It's not here. Okay. I was outside of Midgar? Okay, okay. Oh wait, no, I was thinking about Coral. Right, that was Coral with Barret. Here we go. Oh no, you don't. Taking you down a bit. Gonna love this. This'll do. Brace yourself. Prove your honor to me. Yeah, I do report, Karen. 
Oh yeah! Conflict resolved. Sell that bird, that's right, that's right, son. Yep, yeah, Bonnie, this game is like super sick. Yeah, it looks dope. Like, if you, I, I, I genuinely believe everybody who's played Final Fantasy 7 should play this game. It's like it's that good. It is, it is completely insane to me. But you know what, I'm gonna do to kind of speed it up. I think that I am going to play better. Stop dying. Hold on. I think I'm I think the squirrel dying. is dead in here. Yeah, it smells. And I tried to sniff around and I couldn't find the source. Is it not the trash can? It, it might be the trash can, but I don't know. You didn't take the trash out. Yeah, but it, there's not. It's not like there's barely anything in the trash. Like it's not like I I, I don't actually think it's the trash, you know. One small dead rat somewhere. What are you doing right now? Uh, I'm, I'm basically like fusing my materia so I can just use the really strong stuff for the rest of the game. Mm. Oh, so you're basically like trying to put yourself on god mode. That way you can finish. Yeah. Faster. Do you think it's gonna work? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. I think I think it's worth the uh, I think it's worth the the try, you know. Okay. I have things in my room that I need to put into these giant stockings. Okay. Aren't here at the moment, but I'm going to come back one day, hopefully. Well, we'll see. Maybe. They might. They might come back. <laughs> and Wake's gonna be here. So he doesn't have any family, so he can hang out. Oh my gosh! Yeah, that's a good idea. Sick. So you didn't get one for yourself? No, it, that would be weird to make myself a stocking. <laughs> like I make myself. Oh, what's in here? You know, like it doesn't make any sense. So I don't think that's weird. Is that weird? To put my to put chocolates into my own stockings and then is that, act surprised. Is that? Well, <laughs> I mean, the actual stocking itself. <laughs> um, I didn't really care because they didn't have a rabbit one. That's the real truth. There wasn't a rabbit one that was like cute. That was like 3D like these ones and it and it wasn't gray. Like I was trying to get like specifics so everyone would kind of match-ish. So that when they're sitting next to each other, they look cute. But I couldn't find any that was a rabbit, so... I found mm. one that was a llama, and it looked oddly like me. But I didn't know how I felt about being a llama for Christmas. You should have gotten a llama. Because the stocking is something I would have for, like, ever. Mm -hmm. And so because of that, if it's not gifted to me and it's bought by me, I would have to, like, really think about it. Yeah. If I'm gonna have it for forever. And it was all just too much, so I just bailed out. You just decided against it? Yeah, I just decided to get other people's stockings. Which is way cute. Okay. I mean, look at Jay's. Hers is a fox. She loves foxes. Okay. I mean, that makes sense. Yep. Do you look at this HP up, by the way? Like, it's gonna get to, like, 300%. Yeah, you see, you're showing me this, but I just got here, so... Oh, I'm just going on. <laughs> well, congratulations. <laughs> Isn't this sick? <laughs> I 
I mean, it seems good, and I'm super happy for you. It's badass. Alright, I'm gonna go make myself some tea. I'm gonna find my phone. Um, and I'm going to fill these Christmas stockings. Okay, sounds good. Okay. Wait, what is Exploder Blade? <laughs> Again. Alright, that sounds Again. good. Alright. Okay, bye. Right, we'll see you in a bit. Bye, guys. Chad, say bye, Bonnie.